Acash Conscious Cushioned Crusaders, it's Ed Midsole Bud here. I have for you my non-elite, non-expert running opinions, putting together all the best shoe bargains for you for May 2023. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in people, it is always appreciated. If one of these videos has helped you out a little bit, please do think of subscribing and hitting that bell of notifications when the new videos are launched. Give this video a thumbs up, like too, and share it with your running buddies. It really does help us out to continue growing the channel. Danke schön. Absolutely crackers bargains for you today, so let's get straight into it. Now, Start Fitness have been hammering the bargains home with a special deal for us this week. King Charles coming in with the special Royal 10 discount. They've got the awesome Daily Driver Puma Velocity Nitro 2, complete with a lovely soft upper and Puma grip on the underside. It's got more grip than a Klingon. £46.80 with the Crown discount. Plus, you get free socks, apparently. I mean, you just can't lose, can you? What's not to like for less than 50 notes? Certainly more of a complete purchase than the new Star Wars Jedi Survivor game, or at least in its current state anyway. I love that Velocity Nitro. Lovely combo there of the Nitro foam and then something a little bit more chewy underneath. Loads of sizes available, though I can see these going very fast at this discounted price. Perhaps faster than a Corgi goes for its mongrel mixture. £98.91. That is the price of lots of different colorways of the Puma Forever and Nitro over at Start Fitness. Using that royal discount once again, good old King Charles. Great cushioned bottle with its combo of nitro foam. Two different formulas here which work together in tandem, a bit like a Cadbury's cream egg, or maybe even the perfect roast potato. In fact, Miss Bub cooked some really good ones just now. Soft underfoot and then a more containing version just to hold things together. A bit like a really good drummer in a jazz band. Outsole is Puma Grip Heaven with a pronounced crash pad on the lateral sides. And this one is a consistent lockdown legend. One of those shoes where you just cinch the laces. It's easy to get a good fit. I think it's one of the best all round Puma or sort of any manufacturer model really right now. Down from its retail price by a good 40 smackaroonies, it's definitely worth a go if you find the Invincible run too soft, perhaps a little bit too mushy perhaps, if you want something with a bit more resilience but yet some nice bounce. I think it looks the part too. I've been wearing one of those around for like a couple of weeks since I got back from Boston, just doing all sorts of activities and it seems to do the trick. One for the ladies now. Start Fitness have their Puma Fast R Nitro Elite. That's down to 157 with the Royal discount. All sizes are available on the making of this video. Puma Nitro Elite foam in the mid to forefoot and a more resilient wedge of the Pro foam in the heel, making for a high pace aggressive shoe. For your racing and premium speed sessions only, people. At over £60 off the retail with the Royal Discount, it's a great deal for a high-end racer. I think it's a good companion to have, really, if you've got the Deviate Nitro Elite or the Elite 2. They do different things, really. This one's got a bit more zest to it. Certainly this colorway, anyway. Very engaging, and it promotes a mid to forefoot strike with that stabilizing effect of the rear section of the shoe. Traction is on point. That's where you get with Puma Grip and it completes my Start Fitness Puma Discount Trilogy for today. Sulfur Otherworld. That's the name of this striking colorway of the Saucony Endorphin Speed 3. There's a whole bunch of colorways, in fact, available at Start Fitness. A discount deal of 133. Much appreciated, King Charles, that you've inspired Start Fitness to discount the sales further. I never knew you was into running. Good show. For the faster days, we got that P-Bax midsole with the nylon plate of more limited rigidity, and that's okay. Fits the bill for just about any type of run. People have recently been suggesting over on the community section of the channel as to how versatile the Speed 3 is, and I've got to agree. Today a lovely easy ride around 8 minutes per mile, keeping the effort very easy, setting up some of the faster stuff for tomorrow, and perhaps a longer run on the weekend on the Sunday, because that is of course law that you have to do the long run on a Sunday, right? Hard to beat for general use, and at 133 I think it's an easy win, plus I think you still get some free socks. Lots of sizes, lots of colours, you know what to do. 
We are finally seeing some deeper discounts on the A6 Metaspeed Sky and the Edge, the plus editions at least. Down now to 180 Spondulix at sportshoes.com. Still a higher price, but you know, it's a touch more affordable and every little helps apparently. I really dig the Flight Foam Turbo Midsole in this one. A shoe for perhaps those cadence runners with the Edge. If you want a faster turnover there, I've not had the opportunity to test that one out, but I really did enjoy the Sky Plus. Very wide forefoot landing area and a responsive foam here in both models. It's a bit more high pressure football underfoot rather than this sort of like soft squashy cushion. It'll fire you forward and it's got the grip of the gods. Heaven knows what that rubber's made out of. There's lots of perforations in it. It's more grippy than a frying pan that's lost all of its slippery stuff. There's lots of sizes on this in the Edge. I think you can also get like a 10% discount if you hunt around a little bit. Same price on the Sky Plus, though it's more limited in terms of the sizing. So don't hang about, people. Pro Direct have a whole boatload of the Nike Zoom X Vaporfly Next% 2. Lots on sale right now across a range of colorways, as much as 67 quid off of the actual retail price, though it appears that the smaller and larger sizes are in more plentiful supply than the mid-range stuff. I think we'll only see more and more discounts on the V2 now that Nike have flooded the market with the V3. Not entirely flying off the shelves, it has to be said, probably because they're not all that different really, despite what people might tell you just remember young kipton's excellent run in the london marathon recently he didn't need the v3 the older v2 version was easily enough for the second fastest marathon race of all time sport shoes smashing it out the park this time the takumi sen 9 is now discounted down from the retail we've got a mad price of 120 in that striking pulse mint lucid fuchsia and lucid blue version a variety of sizes people makes for a superb racing and training shoe for your sort of higher speed stuff if you're after a more nimble responsive fit something that's a bit like a kit car or something it's just got the minimum that you need hard to beat on road and pavement with its adidas continental cat tongue like traction as we saw recently in the london marathon it's even got the chops for the full 26.2 i think if you got the form for it though not everybody is going to want to run a full marathon in this one use the code adidas 15 for a further 15 percent off so I think that gets it down to about 50 Earth credits off of the retail price. You can use the extra money you've saved to buy some high five gels. Man, I bought the orange flavour. It's got to be the most slap yourself in the face tangy thing since I ate a whole pack of refreshes on a bus back from Slough watching Yeovil Town in the mid 90s with Mullen Boy. That's a story I will tell you about in further detail down the line last deal for you for today here's one for the only deals and midsole seekers the puma deviate nitro 2 in the ladies sizing up and running i've got this discounted by 50 percent you can grab the black and gold version for only 70 earth credits so that's an insane 50 percent saving half price this is a plated cruiser it does lots of things and it does them very very well you got a little nitro there you got a little nitro elite 2 it bridges the gap really between the velocity nitro 2 and the deviate nitro elite 2 super durable and with an upper that has a slightly plusher feel than the Nitro Elite. There's a hefty slab of the old Puma grip there as well, if you're seeking the traction of champions. Hard to beat really this deal for the ladies version of the shoe. Up and running is your destination for this champion of the bargain running shoes for this month. Have the eagle eyes of Ed Bud missed out on a good bargain? Let us know down in the comments. It's the last time I eat one of those high five energy gels before I do one of these videos. My word. Quick musical interlude for you. One of the viewers, I'm afraid I didn't catch the name, did suggest that I go and check out the new track from The Hives. It's called Bogus Operandi and it was absolutely fantastic. Distorted strut chords at the very start of the track make you realise that you're in for something good. There's lots of fuzzy aggressive guitars here and it kind of reminds me a little bit of when I first heard The Hives really way back in the early noughties. Sounds like they haven't aged a day which is fantastic.
A little bit like me, I suppose. Seems this comes from a new album. Don't think it's out yet. Very interesting cover art on it. Perhaps not in keeping with the music itself, but this one's rough, it's rugged, and I think it's going to make its way into perhaps a harder, long-run playlist. Bogus operandi from The Hives. Thanks for tuning in, people. I hope the running shoe bargains have helped you out once again. Hit that subscribe button and also give this video a thumbs up like. My name's Ed Bud, and I'll be seeing you.